Hey guys, what's up? My name is Art. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're having a very good couple days and um, having a great week. I am trying to. I'm trying to extend working. I'm trying to work up to 10 to 12 hours this week so I can catch up on a lot of things before my vacation because once I get next week, once I get back, it's going to be all hell. Um, I'd like to thank everyone for watching my videos. A lot of times I talk about comic books and I'm trying to branch out into like, you know, movies that I've watched or TV shows that I watched and <laughs> sometimes music. I'm trying to make it a slightly media channel and, um, But, and every now and then throw some kind of lifestyle kind of thing in. And this is one of those lifestyle videos. This has been on my mind for a long time. And uh, it's kind of hard for me to put it into words. So I'm just going to say it out there. Um, hmm. Okay. People in life, a lot of people in life, like myself and other people, we have responsibilities. You know, we have to pay for things. You know, rent, mortgage, car notes, car payments, insurance, and all sorts of stuff. And there's some people who fly the fly and fly, fly in life by the seat of their pants. They rely on other people to help them out in their own situations that they put themselves in. I call it priorities over partying. And people put their party in before their priorities. Now what I mean by priorities, that means rent, gas, mortgage, you know, utilities. Things that help you live. For example, I live in this house. This is my mother's house. I live with my mother. Of course it doesn't make good for the dating scene for me. The dating scene is not the greatest for me because I live with my mom. But thing is, I pay my mom's mortgage, okay. And maybe one day I might tell. One day I might tell you a video about how that all happened. But for the most point part of it, my parents. Well, my mom got divorced from my dad. My dad re never remarried, and he owns his own house. My mother, for a while, tried to get houses and stuff. Didn't work too well, but now she has a house. Her and her husband barely makes it as it is, so I pay the mortgage. Long story short, I have a car note, car insurance. I got credit cards to pay off. I have five credit cards to pay off, so I have credit card debt. I got health problems pay for medication as well sometimes this stuff don't sometimes this stuff is not cheap you know and thing is I have a job that helps me provide for all that I bust my ass to do that okay I bust my ass and the thing is a lot of people are like me I mean, there's millions of people like me that do that we sit we go to a job. Sometimes we love our job and sometimes we don't. And we bust our ass. Take all kinds of stuff. Just to make that dollar bill. Okay. There's some people in life that. They rely on other people to help pay their way. Now, what I, now, all the stuff I'd say before, that was like priorities. Partying is a catch-all term that I use for drinking, drugging, going out to parties, going out to bars, going out to eat all the time, comic books, movies, all sorts of stuff. That's what I call the party. If you saw a lot of my videos, you see me do a lot of comic book mystery box unhaulings and stuff like that. 
And, and guess what? I can do that because I take care of my priorities first. Bills get paid first. Then comes that. For example, this last month in November, I forgot to pay my phone bill. Okay? It kind of happens. It kind of happens. Sometimes you get in a mix of stuff and you start paying stuff, 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 stuff. Like, for example, when I get paid, I get up at 6 o'clock, look at my bank account, see that check in there, start paying those bills. 7 o'clock, I'm working. So between 6 and 7, I'm paying all my bills. And I figure out how much party money I have left after all the bills. Sometimes I catch everything, sometimes I don't. For example, the phone bill is one of the bills I usually forget a lot. The credit cards, they're, they're automated, so I have to make sure that there's money in their account on those days. But anyway, that's my budget. Some people, they go out party. They go out do stuff. I remember in the past, one person, she was like, oh, I need, I need help to pay my rent. I need help to pay my rent. And I'm like, okay, I'll help you out paying your rent. But then she's on Facebook with all these other people. I see her posting Facebook on, after I help her out with the money. She's on Facebook doing all this stuff. And then guess what? It's the same thing again. I need help with a ride. I need help with this. I need help with that. And I'm looking around I'm like, what the hell? Hold on. And I'm like, what the hell? But the thing is, I'm, you know, after a while, that shit gets old. That shit gets old. One per, one person. I need help. I'm, pay, I'm. She texted me recently. I need help with my rent. I'm like, really, really, queen? Need help with your rent? Okay. Supposedly you're dating some dude. And he's supposed to take care, good care of you. So why are you asking me for the rent money? You're two months behind? Oh, are you and him fighting? Are you going? What are you going to do for me? And the problem is you can't do shit for me. You want me to help you pay for your... But I'm like, well... Number one, you moved into an apartment that's $1,000 a month. You have no job. So if you do get a job, you have to hustle, hustle, hustle until you... Till you get till you can pay that. And all of a sudden I was like she's like, Oh, you know what? I I need a ride. I need to pay for a ride. I'm like, no, you don't. You get a job where you can get back and forth. You know what I'm saying? I look up. No. And the answer is no. I'm not paying for that. I'm not helping you pay for that. I'm not going to. The reason why I'm not helping you is because you can go out and work. You can make your money. Quit buying fucking makeup. Quit buying Ch James Charles makeup. Buy the Mary Kay makeup. Buy, buy some cheaper makeup. Instead of buying all this uh, blah, 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 high end fashion clothing, so quit buying all your clothes. Quit buying all this various clothing. Wear what you got to go to work. You know what I'm saying? You buy what you need. But pe people like that don't understand that. Another person I know, she will be having, she, you know, tell you too, a lot of times when I'm be talking to her, there'll be a whole gang of people around her and they're all drinking and shit. Drinking and partying and shit. But then she comes to me, oh, I need some money to help. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I look up and say, whoa. 
See all these people right here that you sit around here partying with? Why don't you ask them? Well, everybody's like, I don't have any money. You got money to party, but you don't have money to help her this girl out with her more with her with her rent? And you expect me to help you out? When you work, instead of partying, you should be paying for your place to stay. And I walked out. I don't like it when you talk like this. Well, guess what? You get lectures. When you keep going to the well too much, it's like a basketball player. Or let's say let's say football, Patrick Mahoney's. If you know he's throwing Hail Marys, what you gonna do? What's the defense is gonna do? They're gonna adjust it so that way they'll stop the Hail Mary. <laughs> but then you gotta switch it up on them. You know, I'm like looking around, it's like, why do these people believe that I have the money? Just because I have a job? Well, because you have a job. You're working too. You live beyond your means. You live in you living in this apartment. You live in this apartment. This apartment's thousand dollars a month. Me, I would have lived in an apartment that's like five, six hundred bucks. You could have saved yourself some money. You know, instead of getting kicked out of your jobs, instead of you working at a bar, you know, take the shit that goes in the bar until you make enough money to get the fuck out. You know what I mean? Shit. My job, too, I sit on my ass all day, but then there's a lot of stress that goes along with that. You know, there's a lot of stress that goes along with that. And sometimes my boss, he's an he's an ass, but I had to deal with that. I sit and I deal with that. People cussing my ass out because they don't understand what the hell is going on. But I had to take that because I get paid to take that from you guys. I don't have to take that from you. I don't have to take it from you. Put your priorities over your partying. Now, the first couple times I tried to do this for weeks and weeks and weeks, it's like 30 to 40 minutes. And I finally got it down to under 20. Because <laughs> this has been on my chest. And this is something I wanted to put on my channel. There's going to be people out there who wants to party all the time. Like the Eddie Murphy song from the 80s. I get when the party of the ten, party of the ten, party of the ten. But when it comes time to pay them bills, let me call Art. If I want to buy a comic book mystery box, if I want to go out and spend 50 to 60 bucks on comic books, I can do that. Bills are paid. I can't go to my parents and say, "Hey, I need so I need hundred fifty dollars for the I need a hundred some dollars for my phone bill." I can't do that. I can't even go to my friends for that shit. I go to my friends, they were like, "Art, don't you got a fucking job? Quit, quit helping other motherfuckers, and you have your shit." Now, the thing is, I'm not saying this exactly for my own personal benefit, but I'm pretty sure that you know someone who does this. Who helps out other people and then they get in the shitter themselves and after a while you're sick and tired of that shit you're sick and tired of hearing them talk about that shit you know for example my man Tony every time I talk to him he always asks I'm like you know after a while I said quit asking this stuff quit asking about that quit saying about that well why not Every time you say something, they start a calling. He didn't believe me. I talked to him, was it last week? Friday morning, Friday and Saturday and Sunday, they were blowing my phone up. I'm like, thanks, man. Love my man Tony to death, but, you know, I was like, I'm trying to get rid of these people. And I'm telling them, no, no, no. Well, why don't you take a picture of some money? That, 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 
and then try to show to try to show them how stupid they are. That's not showing them. I mean, in my opinion, that might work for you, but that's not me. For me, that's not showing them how stupid they are. Just showing me that you're trying to be petty as fuck. But that's fine. I'm o I'm okay to be petty as fuck. But a simple two letter word called no does it for me. <laughs> Can I? No. Can I? Why? Don't have it. Well, when they start pressuring, I said, you got the three grand that you owe me? Do you got three grand that you owe me? You owe me three grand. I settle for three grand. When you got that three grand, then I'll start helping you out. Until then, but then again, if they had three grand, they wouldn't need you. That's the cold. But anyway, I'm trying to keep this under 20 minutes, and I'm almost there. You know someone like myself who done that. I'm pretty sure you know people like, or even if you did that yourself in the past. <laughs> Remember, if you put your priorities over your party in, you should have no problems. When other people do that, you, I start, I start pointing out, I start pointing that shit out to them. I start, I said, well, quit going out all the time drinking. Quit going out all the, all the time. Quit going out all the time. Quit trying to hang out with this person, this person, this one. You might have some damn money. Quit trying to Uber all. Quit trying to hang out with this person Ubering all that time. Well, you're not around. I'm like, I'm not. My job is not to drive you all over the place. That's not my job. You don't pay me for that. If you ain't paying me, why should I help you? If you. But I wanted to take you out. I wanted to hang out and take you out on a date. How can you take me out on a date when you have when you asking me for money? Oh, I wanted to see if you want to go to the hot tubs. I'm like, whoa, 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 what? What? You asking me to help you pay your rent, but you want me to, but you want to hang, you but you want to hang out at the hot tubs. That costs money. And if that costs money, you don't have it. Why are you asking me for it? Oh, so I can take you out to the hot tubs? I don't think so. No. This is Christmas time. Christmas time is a very special time of the year. Especially for me. I need my money. Because I might want to go out New Year's Eve. If, if we can in Michigan go out on New Year's Eve. But anyway. With that being the basic go story goes is this: place your priorities over your partying. Because guess what, the partying shit, putting that over your priorities, not gonna help you out in the end. Whew. Well, that's it. My spot kept it under twenty minutes, or it might be twenty one minutes after all this is over. If you like what I said, you know, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give me a thumbs down. You want me, if you you know leave me a comment. You want me to start helping these motherfuckers? I'm sorry. You want me to help these people? I try not to get age restricted. If you try, if you if you want me to start helping these people out, write to me down below, and I'll try. And you tell me your reasoning. If you say no, they should do it themselves. That lets me know I'm on the right track. I mean, I look up. My, my stuff over here or helping you out pay your mortgage this stuff over here that you see on this wall right oh, like here yeah I may spend some money on this but guess what I can look at it every day and be like that's cool if I help you out <laughs> bye bye but anyway you know if you think you need if you think someone needs to watch this video share it with them okay Yo, if you like what if you like the words that comes out of my damn mouth sometimes, give me a subscription. Let me know what's up. Now, guess what? I'm about to get ready to go to work, and um, hopefully you have a great day. Thank you.